Hello, this is Jim with DC Digital, and today I'm demonstrating a DC-10 UTW system W, and it is a wirelessly controlled with a handheld wireless controller, 2.4 gigahertz, 64 milliwatt RF controller, and it is wireless between the master and the slave secondaries. That is a 900 megahertz radio up to 1500 feet different uh, distance excuse me and uh, these the customer uh, requested that they be PoE uh, powered so we do have our PoE um, circuit board installed on them there's a 12 volt 1 amp PoE um, output and RJ45 chassis mount connector so as you can see they're all connected into a, a Ethernet uh, cable and they're all being powered by that they are a one inch display, DC 10, and uh, all aluminum enclosure. The functionality, it is a count up timer, a count down timer, and also time of day clock. And it can do all functions at the same time if that's what you desire. So I'm going to go, and they do have shift digit technology, so you can go anywhere from 99 hours down to um, seconds. And then it also shows the tens hundredths, but that's not settable. So I'm going to go ahead and show you the functionality of it, <coughs> of them. So right now it's 1.47 in the afternoon. It's time of day. So I'm going to go ahead and switch it to um, clock timer. And as you can see, it zeroed out. It's all zeros. Um, the decimal point, lower right decimal point, indicating that it's in timer down mode. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and switch it to up count up so I'm going to hit the up down button on the controller hit it again and then you can see it toggling back and forth so we have a uh, count up timer I'm going to go ahead and hit start and as you can see we have tens hundreds and seconds and then it shifts over once it gets above 59 seconds hit stop zero it and I'm going to go ahead and shift it to countdown mode so I'm going to set it for hours. We're going to set it for three hours. Well, I missed it. I'm going to set it for four hours. I'm going to go ahead and start it. And as you can see, the colon's flashing, indicating that it's running. When you're in hours and minutes road mode, the, um, the, uh, uh, the, the colon flashes. So I'm going to go ahead and let that run. We're going to switch it to clock mode. So we're 148 in the afternoon. Now you can see that the lower right uh, decimal point is flashing, indicating that your countdown timer is running. I'm going to go back to um, the uh, timer mode on it. And as you can see, we're still 359 and we're still running. I'm going to stop it. I'm going to go back to the last value and we've had it for four hours. So I'm going to go ahead and zero it. I'm going to set it for five seconds. Try to hit it right this time. <laughs> So go ahead and start it. No flashing colon. And so it is zeroed. We're going to go ahead and hit last value. You can, you can do this all day, all night. Go back to last value, start, last value, start. Um, people use these for meetings. They use them for all different kinds of things. Um, this is going to be used in a uh, NASCAR uh, circuit. They're going to be using it, um, I guess, in the uh, control booth, and it, they want it to go with the rest of their equipment, so that's why they wanted PoE um, power. So again, this, uh, and then they all they come with uh, rubber feet for mounting them on the, a table or something, but they do have uh, teardrop uh, knockout holes where you can mount it on the wall if you like. Um, so again, this is a DC dash 10 UTW dash system dash W. It is a wireless multifunction uh, timer system, multi uh, operational. Thank you.